friends welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new my name is Ashley and today I have some weekly laundry motivation for you so this is all the laundry that I need to wash dry fold and put away this week the first load I'm going to start off with is a load of Madison's clothes I'm going to go ahead and just pour them in the washer and get them all washed and clean I'm going to be using my downy light scented beads in the ocean mist scent these are my absolute favorite scented beads if you have not tried them yet i definitely recommend them i purchased them from sam's club but you can also get them at target walmart so definitely go purchase them if you haven't already tried them you will absolutely love them i promise and then i'm also going to be using my method laundry detergent and fabric softener this is my favorite laundry detergent and fabric softener as well and it's in the ginger mango scent and so i'm going to be using those on her clothes and i'm just going to go ahead and put her clothes in the washer so they can start washing i always like to start off with madison's load if i'm trying to just knock out as much laundry as i possibly can in one day and that's what i was trying to do here so if you're new here madison is our oldest and she will fold and put away all of her laundry for me so all i have to do is just put it in the washer get it washed then transfer everything into the dryer for it to dry and she does like me to hang dry certain items but that does not take a lot of time at all either so then once they are done drying, all I have to do is place them in the laundry basket and place that basket in her room and she folds and puts away everything. So when I'm just trying to focus on getting as much laundry done as I possibly can, and I know that I want to knock out all the laundry in one day, like I did on this day, I like to start off with easy loads first, which is like Madison's laundry, Ryder's clothes, and the towels. To me, all of those are super easy, but I do try to fold like, or put in certain loads in between that I don't like doing that much, which would be the boys clothes because they have so many stinking clothes for me to fold and put away. And then mine and Nick's clothes. But like I said already, I started this day off knowing that I wanted to get all of this laundry washed, dried, folded, and put away because I also needed to wash all of our bedding. So I had a lot of laundry to do this week and I did not just want it to like pile over to multiple days. So this is just two days of laundry motivation, but I did tackle a lot of laundry in this video because I did all of our main laundry that you saw at the very beginning, all of those loads, and then I'm also washing all of our bedding. So that's just multiple loads. It did only take me two days. I was very proud of myself. I was able to knock everything out. Um, so if you have some laundry that you need to tackle today, I really hope that this video gives you the motivation you need to get up and get it done. So go ahead and grab that load and let's get to washing, drying, and folding together. Like I always say, there's no better way to tackle some laundry than tackling it with a friend. And I really hope that I can be that friend for you today. But now that I have all of Madison's clothes in the dryer and they are drying and everything that she likes me to hang dry is hanging up to dry, I'm going to go ahead and focus on a load that I do not like doing and that is the older two boys clothes. Just because they have so many clothes for me to sit and fold and put away, it just takes so much time. But I did do something different. Um, I was going to wash all of their clothes at once, but then I just realized they had so many dirty clothes that I divided it up into two separate loads. So I did have to wash two loads or an extra load on this day, but it did help me when it came to folding and putting away just because it didn't feel like I was sitting there forever folding the loads because they were separated. So I do like that. Um, I might continue doing that depending on how many clothes they have when they're dirty. But um, like I said, it just didn't take so much time for me to sit there and fold and put away everything because it was divided up into two different loads for them. But now I'm going to go ahead and take Madison's clothes out of the dryer since they are done drying and then just place this basket in her room for her to fold and put away. And then the boys clothes are done washing at this point. Their first load is so I'm going to transfer those into the dryer, get them dried, and then go ahead and start their second load of laundry. Jump into the car on a Friday night. I want to drive with you. Looking for a bar in the nearest town. I've never seen a sky so blue. We don't have a plan and the night is young. It doesn't matter what we do. There ain't nobody like. There ain't nobody like. You look so beautiful. 
So now that I have Jacob and Jeremiah's second load in the dryer and those clothes are drying, I'm going to go ahead and start an easy load to me, which is a load of towels. So I'm going to throw the towels in the washer and get them all washed and clean while the boys' clothes are drying. And if you're new around here, I always use Lysol sanitizer on my load of towels as well as bedding and sheets. And if we're ever sick, I use Lysol sanitizer on our clothes as well instead of fabric softener. But now I'm in Jacob and Jeremiah's room with their first load of laundry and I'm going to go ahead and take care of that. So I folded majority of their clothes as I was taking it out of the dryer, but I still need to hang their shirts up on hangers, fold their jerseys, as well as roll their shorts because I did not do that while I was taking those clothes out of the dryer. So that's what I'm going to be doing right now. I'm just going to fold their jerseys, hang their shirts up on some hangers, um, roll their shorts and everything else that I did not fold when I was taking it out of the dryer, and then put everything away, hang their shirts up in their closet, and then put the rest of their clothes away um, in their drawers. And then once I'm done doing that, I'm going to head back into the laundry room because their second load of laundry is going to be done drying. So I'll take all of that out of the dryer and I will fold it while I'm taking it out of the dryer again. And then I'm going to transfer the towels from the washer into the dryer and get them all dried. Wanna be free of this heart, yeah. Wanna feel your arms around me. I need you more, need you here. More than I would like to admit Let's forget about tomorrow Yeah Should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again Hold you tight, call you mine Think about you every time I remember that it's over Yeah You never break never lie, you never ever scared of the dark, so why am I the one who cries, I'm so afraid to be left behind, I think about you a lot, it's almost like I can't stop, can't stop, yeah, yeah, you never lose an argument, so I've been trying hard to pretend that I'm okay, it's just a phase, and everything is going just great, about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah I always knew that this would happen Yeah You would find a new distraction I need you more Need you here More than I would like to admit Can we let go of tomorrow? Yeah you never break, you never lie, you never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries, I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot, it's almost like I can't stop Can't stop, yeah, yeah You never lose an argument, so I've been trying hard to pretend That I'm okay, it's just a phase Everything is going just great I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah Goodbye.
So now I'm just taking Jacob and Jeremiah's second load out of the dryer and I'm folding everything so that way I can just take it into their room and put everything away and I don't have to worry about folding it in their room. Once I'm done taking everything out of the dryer, I'm going to take the towels out of the washer, throw them into the dryer because they are done washing so that way I can get them all dried. And then the next load I will start will be Ryder's clothes. I will go ahead and throw his load in the washer and get them all washed and clean while the towels are drying. But I wanted to ask you if you've already started Christmas shopping yet and the reason why I'm asking you this is because I've already started Christmas shopping and that's very unusual of me. If you know me then you know that I'm like a last minute person when it comes to Christmas shopping and I never start before Black Friday. I always wait to see what sale they're going to have on Black Friday on certain items before I start any type of shopping. But this year I started early and I think I really like it. I know every year I say I'm going to but I never do. Um, but this year it's been really nice. I've just came across certain items that the kids have asked for and I've seen them on sale and I'm like, I don't think it's going to go any cheaper than that. And then also most places are offering, if it does go cheaper, they will like pay you back or reimburse you the price, um, and give you like the price that it is at that time. So I just go ahead and I'm getting it and I'm just putting it up and it's been super nice. I'm not so stressed or overwhelmed like I typically am. Um, and also my kids are at that age, well, majority of my kids, the older or three are at that age where the things that they're asking for it's not certain items that I'm going to like have a hard time finding for the most part so that's really nice I remember one time Madison was younger and she really wanted a Doc McStuffins like doctor's kit set thing I don't know it was like a little station that Doc McStuffins came out with and I waited in the Toy Story line for two hours or so before the store opened just to get a ticket to purchase that for her that was one item that I could not find and I finally found out that they were going to restock at a certain location so I got there before church on a Sunday morning to get this for her and I remember standing in line telling the people what I was in line for because you know they were all in line for like the new gaming system that was coming out and when they found out what I was in line for they kind of just chuckled but you know I'm glad I did wait in line because there was other people in line for the same item because they sold out that morning they only had a certain amount and I was able to get my ticket for her and seeing her on Christmas morning getting that just made my whole day but um you know it just made me feel like mama's hard work paid off because I searched for that thing for so long and I finally found it for her and there's been other items too like that boys have wanted and stuff that I've been all over the place trying to find but like I said, the older three are at that age where the things that they're asking for, like shoes and clothes and stuff, has been easy to find. Ryder doesn't really, you know, he'll ask for certain things, but he hasn't asked for like a big thing that's been hard to find either. But I would love to know down below in the comments if you've already started Christmas shopping or if there's a certain item that you are struggling to try to find for your kids because it's like a hot item of the year. Definitely let me know down below in the comments. Ten feet underground When you're so deep You're about to drown When you're in the Lost and found Cause heartaches only Last a day
think we got enough time to sort out all the fights, yeah. to sort out all the lies. Oh, baby, yeah. I don't know. There was a part of me that knew that, and still I'm caught by surprise. Oh. I thought you'd always be mine. Oh, yeah. I guess our dreams fell asleep. There's no passion in the comatose. Yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. Tried so hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. 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 And I thought, it's time I'm letting you go. This time I know it for sure. I just thought I should let you know. Patch up all the scars, yeah. but we smashed up all the parts. Oh, no, no, no. Always knew that you were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. Oh, yeah. I guess our dreams fell asleep. There's no passion in the comatose. Baby, going down, 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 down. Baby, going down, 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 down. Tried so hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Baby, going down, 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 down. Obviously this is day two now and all I did was focus on our sheets and bedding and everything so I just took Madison's bedding out of the dryer and I threw Jacob's bedding into the dryer and now I'm going to go ahead and start Jeremiah's bedding and throw it in the washer and get it all washed and clean. And that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed hanging out with me and I hope I was able to give you some motivation to get up and get some laundry done, get some cleaning done, whatever it might have been. I hope I gave you all the motivation you needed to get up and get it done. If I did, please let me know by liking this video. It really does help my channel out as well. Definitely leave a comment down below because I love chatting and getting to know each and every one of you. And I hope you come back next week for some more laundry motivation and cleaning motivation. I am only going to be posting one video video this week because of Thanksgiving so I hope you guys all have a wonderful Thanksgiving as well and definitely come back next week for some more motivation and I'll catch you in the next one friends. As always thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to hang out with me it truly does mean the world. Bye! Every time we touch, I feel